Hey what's up everyone, welcome back to a brand new video today. I'm going to be attempting to destroy Kira from the Kira Hive. So of course, what in the world is the Kira Hive? So Kira Hive is supposed to be a level 80 quest. It's kind of like the Tower of Ascension quest though, which is supposed to be completed at a level higher than the original requirement. And by the way, the level the higher the level you complete, um, the more XP you basically get. The more XP you basically get, but there is a max amount of XP you get. Like, for example, you can get up to, like, 6 million. 6 million in the Kira Hive. And then, basically... And, of course, basically, there are, like, uh, five dimensions. There's thunder, air, earth, water, fire. And then there's also a master dimension. The master dimension is what I'm doing right now. But of course, um, I want to be able to get some um, more potions. So by the way, first of all, I'm heading into Thanos in order to actually get some potions here. Because here's the thing though, un unlike um, all these other cities, Thanos actually has like level 100 potions as well. So that is very fortunate here. So, surprisingly, we actually got a full hand. So now, for the buffs, I don't think we can go here. I do have a Lutho scroll, so let's go into Lutho now. So, so now I'm in a Lutho. The post merchant should be, uh, oh my god, frames are dropping. I should do this like strash stream. Oh my god, this is actually dropping. All right, so, wow, the post merchant actually looks different, never realized. But let's just go ahead. I think I need all five buffs. I need to like identify those like morph stardusts first, and then to in order to like clean my invent. I actually need to like see which one's better. Turns of this, so that's hundred percent. Uh, forty, eighty-eight, eighty. All right, so this is actually pretty bad. This one's also pretty bad as well. I'll just sell them. Now I'm just gonna go with the current one I get. So, if you don't know my setup, so by the way, I have four weapons right here. So I have a Tempest, which surprisingly is still carrying me through the air... Which probably carried me through the, um, the Kira Hive and the Tower of Ascension. The Rail... The Rail Fect... Level 94 spear, a blade of purity, level 78 for the neutral damage, the earth drift, and the earth drift for for air and earth damage, basically. And the armor I'm basically using is the morph set. I'm basically using the morph set, which consists of uh, stardust. Um, then there's morph steel, morph steel, morph iron, morph gold. Morph Topaz, Morph Emerald, uh, Amethyst, and Ruby. Which basically... And of course, I chose Morph out of all the other sets, cause... Because I think Morph is a very good all-around set, indeed. So, of course, first of all, I think I have to go to First Atlas, and I'll just get a Lutho Scroll, just in case I have to come back here. And now... I did not forget to get those uh, five potion buffs. So I need strength, uh, dexterity, um, intelligence, uh, defense. I need to pouch these, and then also um, I still have agility, so I can just use this. And then of course I go into deathless, and then I'll go to sin for S now, which by the way is up there, and then. For Kale's airship, there we go, we're heading into the Lepus airbase now, so... After this, we're probably gonna go into Ozo Spire, again into Thanos, and then... We're gonna go into Thanos again, and then... And then, of course, back into the Kira Hive, so... Actually, I think this is the best way for... It's probably the best way for me to go. Honestly, just, uh, don't know. I think this is the best way. I mean, since I believe we're hitting Ozone Spire 
quite soon, I believe. Yeah. Big. Also, yeah, there it is. I believe gotta keep going. Um. Well, actually, I think I think the previous way was also pretty good as well. So into Ozo Spire, we gotta go past past uh, Thanos, and then we're gonna go to the Kira Hive. Kira Hive, and then yeah, we go left, and of course. Once we're in Thanos, don't turn left, and uh, we're basically gonna turn right, basically. Then of course you can say the quest, the quest info says like, prepare to enter the chambers of Mistress Kira. He does, Kira does have like a defense of all elements, so. Wait, hold on. Even though this damage is kind of negative, I guess. I guess my main attack damage also increased, and so does my spell damage. So spell damage should be good. So I should probably be using this blade of purity like this whole time. Yeah, I should get all my like five buffs first. I should get my uh, blade of purity first, and then I'll just lay out the order right here. So. I believe, uh, defense, uh, I guess agility, yeah, agility will go, and then you have strength, dexterity, and intelligence, so, let's go, I, be I believe that's the last one, I believe the last room is probably, um, in here, I don't know where, I believe, I believe this is the room, so, yeah, we're full on potions, so we should be good. And we very much got everything, so let's go on. We got agility, and we got all our five buffs. Okay, so we gotta go ahead, get all of them. Oh my god, that is so risky. Oh my god. For real. I think Kira definitely has like uh, multiple phases, for sure. I never realized, I mean, she has like spiders, but then she like slows you down. I think the resistance is also going to be very, very useful as well, so I have to continue using my uppercut spell and my charge occasionally. I don't think my main damage is that nice, I believe I can just use my uh, blade. It just seems very confusing because, I mean, the spiders also, like, teleport as well, so, yeah. We have to put our main focus on Kira right now, so. Let's go, um. So, I believe we have, like, uh, four minutes left. Yes. I'm glad they're very long-lasting. I chose to go into Lutho, not Thanos, because, I mean, because the... Because the the buffs in like uh, Thanos are much weaker than the ones in Lutho. I could also go to Omsword, but yeah, I could also go to Omsword, but I I just had a Lutho scroll on me, so I decided to just go there. Looks to me that this boss is like almost dead. I mean, but I'm pretty sure there's multiple phases here. I just I very much check the wiki. There's probably more phases here. Can't wait. Probably just gonna kill this boss. I sure if there's like blindness. If blindness is actually an effect though. Oh wow, this is wait, what face is this though? I don't even know what face this is. I mean Oh he he wait, she did get blindness. <gasps> oh my gosh. That is so like um Where do we even find him? Or where do I find Kira? I don't even know if I even like gave the resistance right here. That's probably that's primarily the reason why I chose the uh, morph set. Oh my god, that is so risky. Hira's probably like following me. Uh, 
Ooh, she trapped me. Oh my god. She actually trapped me. And it, it is literally like the uh, dreaded, like, corrupted infested pit experience. I literally tried it. The, the IP. The IP, but it's literally just so terrible. Anyway, let's just uh, stop with this, like, uh, dungeon talk. I'll basically show how I basically got through the, um, through the, like, first five levels of the Kira Hive. Well, I just got through the, uh, fire dimension. Not dimension, but the fire level, I should say. Oh my god, that is risky. Jeez. Kira's fast, jeez. She's so fast. Oh my god. If the webs weaken my damage, I'm not even sure like... Oh wow, I'm pretty sure my my frames are definitely... I get right here. For sure. Oh my god, that is so risky. I keep saying that. Anyway, so by the way, I got through the uh, Thunder Dimension using like my main set. I basically attempted the Kira Hive at around like level 98, so... And of course, I got through the uh, remaining. I got through the um, remaining of the levels using the champion armor. I kind of struggled on the uh, water. I kind of struggled on the water level. I mean, so I mean, so that means why I had to alternate my champion armor as well. But either way, champion armor did actually carry me. But oh my god. Kira's seriously trapping me. For real. I gotta keep myself. Gotta keep myself healthy. For sure. But honestly, the air boss is definitely very tricky. Oh my god. This is. He's just. He's, I feel like he's just pulling me out. I feel like it's buff time. It's time. I should get all my buffs now. Alright. I don't care what order this is, alright, that's... I, I got them all, so... Um... Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, I should probably put my chest on a horse now. I should get my horse just in case, I mean... Just in case it becomes, like, too annoying. Wait, so Kira's a mage now. That is pretty weird, actually. Well, I'm glad it's, like, the same stats, by the way. Wait, how much damage am I doing? Wait, 2k? Never really actually done that much. Without, like, any, like, uh, buffs. I have to make sure, um, I get the resistance. There we go. There we go. I got resistance. So, this should be good. Gotta make sure I heal up, um. Oh my god. I'm actually doing it. I su I may have I su I may have jinxed it. I mean, as soon as I said there like would be blindness, I mean, I, I, if there was blindness, I'd be annoyed. Yet yeah, there was blindness in like the second phase, and the third one as well. Wait, I'm just shredding her. I'm literally just shredding her. That is so. That's so genius. I should just say. I'm probably just gonna keep uh circling around, um, heal myself up gonna keep using spells right here i'm gonna try using my batch spell um uppercut will also work as well um kira's probably right there oh my god i'm almost doing it let's go i can't believe i'm probably i guess i'm not sure how many phases kira has but i don't know how many Well, to be real, I don't even know how many phases Kira even has. I'm pretty sure this would be his, like, next... F if Kira has, like, another phase, I mean... Oh my god! Master Catalyst? Darn! That is so neat. Oh my god. You... You are... I like you. You're capable enough. Perhaps we could be allies in the future. Let's go! We destroyed Kira! 
Nice. I believe I just got to tell the answer. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Damn. That is so good. I got a master voucher. Oh yeah, that's 6,000? 6, 6 million. 250,000. And I'm probably just gonna get another weapon here, so... Now that's the thunder, air... I think pretty sure the master is all the way down there, so... Well, I believe there's a trinket merchant. Um, no. Probably not. Well, there's a, uh... Well, I'm glad you could, like, refund. I'm actually pretty glad I, I maybe mean, I can refund it. So there's, I guess there's an armor. I guess we don't need armor, nor do we need accessories. We just need, like, weapons, so. I got an in infused hive spear. How much uh, neutral damage does that do? Hmm. I really don't know. That's 160 uh, to 210. What other beta effects do they even have? Uh, I actually don't know, but... I think I may as well just use it. Wait, they have five powder slots. That is ridiculous. So I guess I'll just go ahead and end this video right here. So, thank you all guys very much for viewing. I finally managed to destroy uh, Kira on my uh, Iron Man Windcraft. And this, by the way, is going to be part of my like 200 days video today's video which is not really going to be like it's not really going to be soon but expect it in probably a year but anyway thank you all very much for watching again and of course i will make sure to release 100 days asap actually is that the expected date of release is around august or september so stay tuned for that otherwise see you guys goodbye